Hey, Avid Seniors, it's Chavez. One last lecture for you before I send you off to college. You did it. All of those binder checks and TRFs were for this moment right here. So before you go, I want to remind you, don't ever let your fears make those decisions for you. And call me anytime, whenever you need anything, and you got this. I'm so proud of you. Um, first and foremost, I just want to say congratulations um, to the class of 2018. I'm extremely proud of you. And one of the things that makes your group so special is that uh, four years ago when you guys were a freshman, that was my first year here at Poly. So I'm so excited to have had a number of you since freshman year to now senior year. Um, and getting able to see you um, mature over the past four years and now um, being a part of this special time of you graduating and maturing into adulthood. Um, so I'm so proud of you and just want to send my just deepest congrats to you. And just to remind you, um, always make wise choices. Um, make sure that you think about the choices that you make and just be successful at whatever it is that you have passion for. All right, congratulations. Hi everyone, um, so Senora Suleiman, and my advice to all of you who are going off to college is follow your dreams. Don't let anyone get in your way or tell you that you can't do something that you really love. Um, every single one of you is special and unique and you need to remember that. Keep in mind, ladies and gentlemen, that not all roads are easy, but even those that are most difficult um, are um, conquerable. So, have fun, enjoy, and pursue those dreams. Bye. Hi, seniors. Uh, first of all, I'm really proud of you. So happy to see you graduate and go on to all your different wonderful journeys that you're going to have. What I want to say to you is it doesn't matter if you go to college, career, military. What matters is that you do something, and that you do something that puts some joy into your heart and something that can hopefully make a difference in your life, your families, your friends, but it doesn't really matter what you do as long as you go on and do something that you know the time's gonna go by anyways. Thanks. Um, so my advice to seniors going to college is to be confident but not arrogant. Um, stay humble, take pride and joy in your actual accomplishments, and never stop learning. Um, some of the best advice is one that I got from my mother when I was in you guys' shoes, um, graduating, leaving home for the first time, and it was in a letter from her, which was proven to be both very wise and true after I had experienced many hardships through the years, and it is this. Suffering will happen in your life as an adult. You will fall from time to time, but this is okay. You are a human being. However, those are oftentimes your defining moments where you will learn who you are and what you are made of. Just remember, your success as a human being is not questioned or determined by your falls, but by how you pick yourself back up. You are all stronger than you think. Good luck and much happiness to you all. All right guys, just wanna say um, congratulations and just a couple of little things I wanna pass on to you. Um, one for thing for sure is uh, just stay motivated, stay positive. Uh, if there are some goals that you have, make sure you complete them as best as you can to the best of your abilities. Stay on target, um, you know, enjoy life, have fun, um, be the best you can be, be kind, be caring, and, and love what you do. Enjoy life. Congratulations. Congratulations, class of 2018. I would want to let you know that you are never going to be able to control the circumstances that happen in life but you can most definitely control the way you respond to them. So always try and see the bright side of things and stay positive. Yeah, first piece of advice I would give is just enjoy this time. Um, there, there's a special time and, and it won't ever be like this again where you're always around your friends and, and there's so many people around you, you know, and you're gonna be going off to new beginnings. So make sure you slow down and enjoy this time. Uh, in regards to your future and in school and in college, just be sure to be kind. I think you'll find more happiness through kindness than you will through anything else in your life, so that'll be my Congratulations, class of 2018. You guys did it. You're now moving on to college. Uh, I wish nothing but the best for you guys. 
Um, make sure you stay in touch. Make sure you come and talk to us. Stay updated. Check us out on Instagram. Follow us. Make it happen. All right, guys. See ya. Hi, class of 2018. Well, that graduation day is finally very, very close. And for some of you, it seemed like it would never come. And for many, you're a little bit scared. But you've already overcome so many obstacles and so many challenges, and you've been resilient. So just a little piece of advice. Remember, when those obstacles and great opportunities arise and self-doubt rears its ugly head, ask yourself the question, if I had no fear, what would I do? And then be fearless. That could be the game changer. I am blessed to have known you. I am blessed to have worked with you. You will forever be in my heart. Congratulations, class of 2018. Congratulations on this huge milestone that you've accomplished. Best of luck. Those of you that are going away, yes, you're gonna get homesick, and we all did. And those of you that are staying home, get on it, get responsible, follow your dreams. Good high school, you are moving on to the workforce. And we are getting grateful for all that you've done here in high school, but when you go to college, it doesn't matter where you go. It's all about the work ethic that you have when you go to your job. So when you get to your job, you're all gonna have different um, degrees from different colleges, and those don't matter, from ITT to Cal State San Bernardino. You can all have the same job and get the same pay. So keep working hard, and you'll have success in your future to come. Hey, new graduates. This is Ms. Fari, and my advice to you um, as you go to your next chapter in your life is to don't be afraid to change your mind. Try new things. You, you may be going to college to be a doctor and, and get in two or three years and decide you want to do something else. That's okay. Uh, whatever you do, um, be the best you can be. It's nice if you can go to Stanford or Berkeley or Annapolis, but maybe you're a student that you got into Cal State and that was just where you're at. I guarantee you employers will see the work you've done if you're the best you can be at it. Um, and and it, that'll be reflected in your, your ability to be hired and, and make a good salary. And that's my advice. Hey, we want to give a big shout out to our seniors who are going on to a four year college. We are so proud of you. Hey, Tessa. Sydney. Trinity. Celeste. Selena. And Jenna. We are so proud of the work you've done for this program. And it's been a real honor to work with you for the last year, or two, or three, or some of you four. And we're excited to see what you become. Your sense of humor and your dedication to the program, your dedication to your schooling as well as your art has been so admirable. Come back and see us. Come back and see us. Bye.